Good morning. This is Local Business Spotlight on 99.9 AM 1370 WFEA. I'm your host, Mike Morin. Today, I welcome Rachel Marino. She is owner of Marino Health and Wellness in Londonderry. We'll give you the location here a little later in the program. It's all about pain management and medical aesthetics and living your best life possible. And it's hard to do that if you're in pain. And you have some alternate solutions and ways that maybe people haven't heard about. So maybe give us a full view of, you know, the 10,000-foot view because you've been here before, but it's been a while. Yes. Yep. It's been a little while. And things have changed since we were last here. We've added new services. Um, but like you said, pain management is a big side of our practice. That's actually how we first started. Um, we started primarily pain management, um, helping people with mainly arthritis. So we're talking knee pain, shoulder pain, hip pain, people who don't necessarily want a surgical joint replacement. So we're providing them with a regenerative medicine option, which uses the body's natural ability to heal itself. So uh, you clearly have a very deep background in, in that aspect and lots in medicine as well. So tell me, for people that maybe don't know you, uh, a little bit about your, your credentials and who you are. Sure. Yep. So I'm a family nurse practitioner, board certified. Um, I've been in the medical field going on about 17 years now. I started as a registered nurse working in different Boston hospitals. Um, the majority of my time was at Boston Children's and then went back, um, got my master's degree, became a nurse practitioner and decided I didn't necessarily want to work in primary care which is what I had gone back to school for. But once you see what options are out there, um, it really opened up my eyes to this other world. So the regenerative medicine side of things, which not traditional, it's more of that alternative route in just the success that I've seen with it over the years has been incredible. Um, I started working for somebody else and completely built up um, his regenerative medicine program, and then after a couple of years of that, actually opened up my own business with the nurse I was working with at the time. So with all your years working in the Boston Hospital and the Children's and stuff, you saw a lot of things that clearly made an impression on you, and you, you kind of thought there must be a better way to help people with chronic pain in, in certain categories. Absolutely. Absolutely, I did. Um, some of the time that I spent was working in kind of the operative area, not necessarily in the operating room, but I would see patients after. Um, and just the amount of downtime, the amount of pain that they were in after these procedures, and then the fact that it's not always guaranteed that you're going to feel better after a surgery or that it's even going to fix the problem that you went in there for. Yeah. So the fact that we can offer something that is completely minimal to no downtime at all, um, most people drive themselves in and drive themselves home from their injections. I live with somebody who is in a lot of pain because uh, as a 40-year uh, uh, type 1 diabetic. So as you know, that has lots of later in life things that, that create a lot of pain issues, including arthritis. And you did bring that up a minute ago. So talk a little bit about the advanced arthritis relief protocol. And I think that also touches on a, a knee program that you're uh, very exclusive to in this area. It does, yes. So we started this program a few months ago, and we were hesitant to bring on insurance-covered procedures just because of all of the headaches that come with insurance and trying to get approvals and things like that. Um, they don't cover the regenerative medicine options, so we were looking for an alternative for people um, that really it wasn't feasible for them for the cash pay model. So we joined this program. It's a nationwide program. And what's it called? It's called the Advanced Arthritis Relief Protocol. Okay. So it's mainly for knee arthritis, and it's covered by Medicare and most private insurers. Um, and we are really, really excited about it because now we can offer this to more people, and the success rate is amazing. So everybody that has started the program with us has gotten better range of motion, less pain. We had somebody come in the other day who uses a cane every single day. She was just driving by our office and popped in to show us that she's not using her cane anymore. So it's pretty amazing. And it's a six-week program. Um, it's 30-minute appointment. They get a quick injection under x-ray guidance, and then they walk right out the door, come back the following week, and we repeat it for that full six weeks. And as I understand it, uh, you are the only, I guess, uh, participants in this particular program, what, in New England? 
In all of New England. Wow. Yes. Yes. We were actually saying all of New Hampshire, and I just found out all of New England. <laughs> There's no other providers offering this exact program. I mean, it's such a, it seems like such a slam dunk good idea. Why wouldn't there be others, I wonder? Or maybe there will be at some point. I mean, there's room for all of you of course. at some point. Of course, yeah. Um, there are – so there are similar programs out there, but it's just – it's a different product. So the product that we're using, um, it's a, a gel injection, a hyaluronic acid gel called okay. GenVisc 850. Um, and it's a superior product to what the majority of our patients have had before. Probably and cortisone. And well, cortisone, yep. And then there's also other types of gel mm-hmm. injections. Okay. Um, so this one is different, and it's actually a five shot series instead of three. The other types usually you go in three times. Um, most people do it blindly; they don't do it under fluoroscopy guidance. Okay. So that's part of our program is that we actually have to see the needle going into the joint capsule to make sure that you're putting it into the correct position. Um, research has shown that the blind injections are not as accurate because you can actually miss the joint capsule sometimes. So it gives our clients also a sense of security that the ones who do want to watch it, some close their <laughs> eyes, but the ones who do want to watch it, they like to see, you know, that the needle is going right there. You can see the fluid spreading throughout the joint, and it's just a really cool experience for them. Is this something that uh, – I know cortisone is something that you can only give a certain number of times. Mm-hmm. So is this procedure able to be repeated should should need it? Should it need be? Yes. It's every six months it will be covered. Okay. So what we do is a three-month follow-up just to check in, see how everybody's doing, um, obviously sooner if needed. Um, And then we bring them back in six months and see if they want to repeat the series again. I say it's kind of like getting a tune-up for your car or an oil change. Even if you're still feeling good, you want to stay feeling good. You don't want to go back to how you were feeling in the beginning. So um, we we definitely keep in close contact with all of our patients and make sure that they're not taking steps backwards. I'm guessing that a large part of the population has some kind of knee pain. I'm I'm thinking of all the guys that played high school football or college or pro. Yes. I mean, you probably see... The full gamut of people who have different reasons for this knee pain. We sure do. We have a lot of people who have had prior sports injuries, a lot of people that were just hard on their bodies, Mm -hmm. um, weightlifters, both male and female, a lot of construction workers come in. um, And we just, (laughs) we had a pilot the other day too who said because his knees are up cramped in that cockpit all day flying, you know, it just over time. They, they started bothering him more and more. So, yeah, we, we see it all different people. Sounds like a groundbreaking procedure and certainly an alternative to what people might be expecting. Uh, how long have you been uh, part of this program? So we started this program in September. Okay. Um, and it's just been taking off. And like I said, we are so, so excited about this. Um, my nurse, Ken, who is very much involved in the program, um, he's kind of like my my partner with that side of things. Sure. So. Uh, before we take a break, which we will in just a moment, I do want to acknowledge that you have won a couple awards recently in the Best of 603 contest. Must be nice to get that kind of public validation. I'm, I know your patients love you, but there will be some people that maybe read what you're all about and say, yeah, I, I could vote for this company. Yeah, it was it was kind of surprising, um, honestly. So we were nominated at, in the medical aesthetics category and also as um, best med spot in the state. And the medical aesthetics made sense to me because I'm a nurse practitioner. I have registered nurses on staff. We have high tech devices. It really is a medical clinic. Um, but then when we won med spa, when they called, I hung up the phone and I said, wow, that's amazing. And my staff said, what? I said, we just won best med spa in New Hampshire. When did we become a med spa? <laughs> so, I mean, I, it, I guess I guess we are now, too. But it's because we have such a wide array of aesthetic services now, too. We've completely grown that side of our practice, especially over the past year, that now we're in that category as well. So you're, we're excited. As you said, nurse practitioner, Ken is an RN. And I know a lot of your other staff. Very highly qualified. Yes. Yep. I have several registered nurses on staff, Mm -hmm. um, and they've all been highly trained, and, you know, we we know what we're doing. Well, I spend my life with a retired nurse, (laughs) and whenever anything goes wrong, I want you to swab me for the COVID test. I want you to give me my shot or whatever is needed, because nurses see it all and do it all, and 
probably underappreciated in many cases. Absolutely. That's what she tells me. I assume you would concur. Absolutely. Yeah. It's. I worked in the hospital for many years. It is not easy. No. And I didn't and even have harder to do now, it. Right with I, what's going on. I didn't have to do it during a pandemic. So right. my my heart goes out to all of my wow. former coworkers and all of our first responders that have been in the heat of this the whole time. Well, our first half went by really quickly. Very interesting information. Marino Health and Wellness. 50 Nashville Road in Londonderry, MarinoHealth.com. Rachel Marino is my guest. It's all about living your life the best way possible, pain-free. And we'll continue. I've got more questions for uh, for Rachel here in just a moment. You're listening to Local Business Spotlight, 99.9 AM 1370 WFEA, and we'll be right back. Welcome back. Local Business Spotlight, 99.9 AM 1370 WFEA, with me, Mike Moore, and your host, Marino Health and Wellness in Londonderry, and its owner, Rachel Marino, is here. And other, I know we're going to meet Ken one of the next times, I, I suppose, uh, as well, because he has a really interesting background in trauma and emergency medicine. How does that kind of help him with his job, or is it j- just a great background to have? It's, well, it's a great background to have, but it's yeah. also very helpful, um, you know, for things like our IV vitamin therapy that we mm-hmm. do. Ken is our go-to for IVs all the time. If you think about trying to put an IV in in the middle of a trauma <laughs> in an emergency room, they, the ER nurses are always amazing. Um, but he also used to work a lot with um, orthopedics, and he would see people after knee replacement surgery and after a shoulder surgery. And when he first started working in this world of regenerative medicine with me, he thought I was crazy telling people you can get better without surgery. But then he actually started seeing that you can. And he's a believer. I've injected his shoulder before. Um, You know, his wife has been in. She's been a client of mine as well. So now it's we like to turn people who are skeptics into believers because, you know, it is amazing. Hmm. That's that's very cool. So I, I did want to at least acknowledge him because I know he's a very important part of, of what you do at Marino Health and Wellness. So let's let's go from knees to other things because you cover so much more that we don't have total time for, and that is laser and light technology to help rejuvenate skin. Well, duh, who doesn't want that, right, <laughs> as we get older or... Exactly. We see things that we don't like. I don't know if it's unwanted pigmentation or wrinkles or give me a little bit more about this. Both of those are Mm -hmm. big. And honestly, I think the amount of time that people have spent in their homes over the past couple of years or on Zoom calls, just staring at our faces more than we ever have before, you start to notice things. You say, when when did I get crow's feet? Or when did that brown (laughs) spot show up on this cheek? And we've seen a lot of that. We've seen a lot. I had a woman come in the other day, and she said, I just looked in the mirror, and I said, when did I become an old hag? <laughs> <laughs> and I said, well, first of all, you're not. but a Good answer. You know, yeah, but we always ask people, what are your concerns? And then we give them multiple ways that they can address it, whether it be an entire skin resurfacing of the face and neck. Um, the great thing is that we do have several devices from Alma Lasers, um, which I am a little biased, but I think they do have the best technology. Well, but go ahead and expound on that just a bit. Why is it so good? Yeah, it's, I mean, they are always, always trying to improve, number one, the client outcomes, and number two, their relationships with the providers. So they provide exceptional training. They provide exceptional service. They don't put a product out there unless they know that it's going to do exactly what it says it's going to do. Mm -hmm. Um, They don't have any inferior products out there. All of their laser devices really are amazing. And when people come in and I show them our before and after pictures, they're floored with some of them that I say minimal downtime. So we're not talking the old school lasers where you'll have two to three weeks of just needing to hide out because your face... Yeah, stay out of the sunlight. Yeah, well, not just that. Stay out of anybody seeing you because it looks like we've peeled off the, yeah. the top layer of your skin. And I mean, they really have. So we the most downtime you're going to have with our devices really is 24 hours, maybe a little bit more if we go super aggressive. But um, it's amazing that you can get the same results at with, you know, just... Maybe 24 hours, like mm. I said, and and it's people are loving it. They come back, they do their laser treatments, and then they get on a maintenance plan because we are going to continue to age. I have not figured out how to stop the hands of time yet. <laughs> Still working on that. But um, so I tell people, you know, again, it's it's easier to maintain. You've invested in your skin. Now you need to continue to invest in it, obviously. Um, so we have the Opus Plasma. We were the first in New Hampshire to have that. It's 
technically not a laser. It uses fractional plasma technology, which we can't get into all the details. We don't have enough time, but um, just believe me, it's amazing. Um, and then we have a laser device that has 70 different FDA-approved applications. So we can do things like brown spot removal. Um, it can lift tighten tone, lines, wrinkles, spider vein removal, um, facial veins, things like that. It can also do toenail fungus, which we don't really like to advertise. I get into too much, but it does literally everything head to toe. Um, and then we've just added on the beautiful laser liposuction, which for people who are looking for body contouring, we have non-invasive measures. We have an M-Sculpt Neo, we have a CryoSkin. Um, but now for people that are wanting a little bit more, it's um, instead of going in and having general anesthesia for a liposuction with a lot of downtime, this one, it still uses, um, it, it's a similar procedure, just less downtime, a little bit safer because it does have the laser. It's separating the fat cells and keeping them viable so we can actually transfer them now too to other parts of your body. Hmm. So if you want fat taken out of your abdomen and put in your face as facial filler, we can do that. Can you sculpt me to have some abs? Because right now I'm a Absolutely. one. I'm a one pack. I'd like yep. to at least go up to a four pack. We can do that. <laughs> we can get up to a six pack. <laughs> That's amazing. Yep. Yep. So, so there's a lot going on here. Again, as you pointed out, and you're right, we don't have time for everything. So when somebody comes in and they meet with you with a consultation, or come in for the procedure, you know, how do you make them comfortable? How do you talk them through it? Because you know, some people are a little fear of the unknown, and maybe they're taking a chance on something. They're taking your word for that obviously works. So how do you kind of make somebody relax and how do you talk them through it? So we we have a very um, family type vibe in our clinic. Mm -hmm. People walk in and they know just our staff. It's just a nice feeling that they get. So I've heard from multiple people that they immediately feel calmed. They feel welcomed. Um, the way that we talk to them, it's more tell me what what you want done or tell me what's bothering you rather than, I mean, if we're talking about knee pain, I don't just look at an x-ray and say, okay, this is what we need to do and make it like an assembly line for knees. We really get into it. We do a full exam. We talk about what have you been done? What have you had done before? What are you nervous about? And we really put their minds at ease. Um, and then during the procedure, I always have a nurse in there with me in case somebody needs help to, to kind of relax. But um, we, I mean, it's virtually painless. We have people that are scared of needles. They faint from having blood drawn and they do completely fine with anything. And then with the aesthetics, um, you know, there's really not a lot of pain with anything that we do. Anything that is uncomfortable, we use a numbing cream. Um, and I explain to them all ahead of time, this is what's going to happen. We explain things as we're doing it because there's nothing worse than sitting there and not knowing what somebody's doing to you. Um, so we just make sure that it's it's a calm atmosphere and, um, you know, frequent communication. That, boy, that's the word I was just going to say. I've noticed over the years that dentists, at least the ones I go to, have become better at communicating. And it's also on the patient to tell you. I have a sensitive spot on one of my teeth. I say, okay, would you just give it a little numbing gel when you start going in there with the, the scaler? And I think it's a two-way thing, and probably you need to encourage your patients to give you feedback on what they're thinking. Absolutely. Yep, yeah, we do. And we, we listen to that. I think sometimes maybe they're not used to, to people asking for that. Um, but we definitely, you know, we, we want to know what are you afraid of and what can we help, um, not just for the procedure, but what can we help to make it more comfortable for you and just a better experience. We want people to come back, and they do. So um, we're down to about a minute and a half. I would like to have you explain how you deal with finances with some people. I know you've got various... Uh, platforms or systems that can actually help, uh, I suppose, in a credit sense or in yes. in a few cases, uh, medic not Medicare, but uh, the knee therapy coverage as well. Mm -hmm. So tell us, how are we going to pay for the procedures that you're going to do for us? Yes. So for the procedures that are not covered um, by insurance, we do use care credit. So it's essentially a medical credit card um, that you can use. They have up to 12 months to pay it off, 0% interest. Um, we can also accept um, HSA and FSA cards in most cases as well. So um, we we find ways, and it's not always that you have to pay all of that up front at one time. So Yeah, that's always the uh, the elephant in the room is what's it going to cost me and how exactly. can – because it's definitely worth it, but if you can ease that kind of pain, you're yes. onto something, right? Exactly. Give my wallet an injection, please. Yep, <laughs> <No>. yep. <laughs> So, Rachel Marino with Marino Health and Wellness, 50 Nashua Road, uh, Unit 107 in Londonderry. 
Uh, very helpful website, by the way, MarinoHealth.com. Phone number is 603-336-2011. We are out of time, and I hope that you'll come back again because there's so many areas we didn't get into about pain management and living the best life you can pain-free. Absolutely. I'll be back. Thank mm-hmm. you very much. Thank you.